I'm going to do a little small update here. I picked up a couple of Palazoas. Um, this guy here is purple, which I thought was kind of weird. I'd never seen just a, a straight purple Pally colony before. There he is. So I threw him up there with the Zoanthid Garden. And another one down here, it's kind of red and green. It looked kind of rainbow to me at the time. I don't know. It's still nice. Nothing wrong with that. The nuclear greens are, of course, growing like crazy. I'm having a lot of good growth out of these uh, candy canes as well. There's a lot more heads on there than when I bought them. I wish those neon ones would grow as fast. They are growing though. There's more heads there than when I bought those. Even got a new little baby blue mushroom. A little blue metallic striped mushroom. Looks like he had a baby right up above him there. And this SPS coral. Not quite sure what he is. I mean, I know he's a Capricornus Montipora, but I don't know the name. He's red and green. Maybe like a chili pepper Monty or something like that. And then this guy here is growing and not RTNing on me. Everybody in this tank's pretty healthy. Got good Recordia growth. Recordia seem to like my tank a lot. And I'm glad because I like them. The green star polyp is of course taking over. <laughs> that rock. Oh, and this clam down here is getting huge. Really getting big. This Recordia here is doing well also. I added a phosphate reactor trying to fight the cyanobacteria. I filled it with bio pellets and of course the big rumor is that that fights phosphates and nitrates instead of just phosphates like GFO. So we'll see how that works out. It's only on about week two and I've seen a small reduction in the nitrates. Phosphates are still registering zero. The other tank has finally finished its cycle and it's all ready to go. I've got the protein skimmer. Uh, I've got the refugium. I've Still haven't set up the electrical yet. Waiting to get a full day off so I can cut the power off and install the GFCI. But it's finished its cycle, and next week I'll be ordering my Rose and Enemy and Gold and Maroon Clown fish for this tank. Not going to be a coral tank, going to be more of a fish that you can't put in a coral tank tank <laughs> so I can have the best of both worlds alright that's about it